Hi, I'm Philippa Spencer. Um, I'm a senior uh, principal statistician at DSTL, which stands for Defence Science and Technology Laboratories. I don't think we should underestimate how much these things make people feel valued. Um, people work really hard to cross defence, um, and sometimes it's it's about the actual work that we're doing rather than what we gain from ourselves. And so for someone to notice how hard someone's working and the great achievements they're making, uh, it's just massive confidence boost to that person. And I think people should, you know, look to the staff that generally don't seek recognition for what they do and, and nominate them because it just gives you time to sort of take stock and realize about the impact that your work is having and how much, how valued your colleagues see you. I mean, firstly, to be nominated was, a, was an amazing accolade in, in itself. Um, you know, to hear what colleagues thought of you and thought that like I was worthy of such an award was just, yeah, it was quite overwhelming. I, I, I work, you know, you, you keep your head, when you're working in, in, in your workplace, you, you work very hard from task to task. And what the nomination actually made me sort of look up and see what others saw in me, um, which was a massive confidence boost. And then, when I saw who else was nominated, I just felt incredibly privileged and grateful. Um, well, firstly, on a personal level, so many people have come up to me to say how well deserved it was and how pleased they were for me. Um, and that that was unexpected and, and, and really heartwarming. Um, What's happened since is I've had a lot of opportunities to do things. So on a, on a technical level, I've suddenly been invited to be a keynote speaker at conferences I never expected to be invited for. So there's a cyber science conference going on in the next couple of weeks and I'm going to be one of the keynote speakers. Um, the, the Institute of Mathemat Mathematics and Applications gave me an honorary fellowship uh, because of my award and suddenly the profile that I'd achieved because of it, which was amazing. Um, I never even thought about things like that happening. Uh, what else has happened? I got to judge the Raspberry Pi PA consulting competition. That was so much fun. Um, what else has happened as a result? I've had a lot of recognition from my organization. Um, my chief exec um, has mentioned me quite a few times in his uh, talkbacks to the organization, which is um, very, you know, it makes you feel valued and uh, unnoticed as well. The recognition has been pretty amazing actually. I can win it. There's absolutely no reason why anyone else, any other woman who's working as hard as I do can win it across defence. They just need to get nominated. <laughs> yeah, there's an overwhelming feeling of, of emotion, like uh, disbelief, gratitude, uh, privilege. Uh, yeah, I wasn't sure what, what to think because it was just, I, I never expected it quite frankly. Um, and then afterwards, when I had time to sort of, you know, calm down about it and process it, I just, yeah, it was just such an amazing confidence boost and just an overwhelming feeling of gratitude that people across the defense community actually recognized me that way and felt that I deserved that award. So here's my award. Try to make it so it's not too reflective of life. So that's my Woman of the Year award. And here is my outstanding contribution. Oh, what?